I, re I remember him playing for Fiji Sevens at Scotston, and I was down in that, and I see it very close to the the um, the pitch, and I saw a six foot six. A uh, huge man running up the wing, putting offloads in, uh, and, I, and I, I knew the name, name, but I didn't know the player that well, so I went straight to look for Nikola, Nikola Matawalu to ask more about him, and he said that he'd, he'd be keen to come to Europe. Um, a couple of months later, we managed to, to bring him across. He played one pre-season game, which was against Exeter, uh, and he was in the white channels offloading a lot and we thought, great, this, this player is going to be a point of difference. Um, there's not going to be a second row or forward like him in the Pro 12 at the time. He did have to go back to Fiji to uh, finish off his um, military service. Uh, but when he, when he eventually came uh, for that three years, I think it was at Glasgow, he was outstanding. He developed into a leader on the field as well. He, he captained uh, in one of our games when a captain went off injured, led the lineouts. He became very close to our players. I think he's still the godfather, he's the godfather to one of Ryan Wilson's children. So it's been great to see his development and see how much he became a part of, of Glasgow and how much he loves coming to Scotland.